What up guys, Perfection here. Today, I want to talk about um, the most efficient way to use your coins. Because I get, asked, I get asked a lot in some of the chats that I'm in about what I spend my coins on when I use them or get them. And how they could better spend those coins. And I hear a lot of people talking about how they buy Pokeballs. Well, I, I've never bought Pokeballs. I don't see the point in spending coins on something... As, as disposable as a Pokeball. I mean, you can throw... Now, with the new catch rate, you can throw 5, 10 balls on a, on a Pokemon that's less than 500 CP. So, what I recommend is spin your coins when you get them. If, it, you, know, if, you're, if you spend in the game, cool. If not, if, you, if your coins are a lot more scarce because you get them through gems or you get them through doing... Uh, Google, the Google opinion rewards, you know, where you get them from doing surveys, you know, it's a lot slower to get the coins. So, you know, take better advantage of how to get those coins, you know, of what to do with those coins. So, so instead of buying Pokeballs, I buy bag upgrades because, you know, I, and, and I hear people from rural, uh, sorry, I can't even talk right now. The rural areas, they have more, like a lot less Poke stops. So it's hard for them to get Pokeballs. But what I do is is I buy, or I picked up some bag slots because what I do is is when I do go into town where there's a lot more Poke stops, you know I'll take 30 minutes to drive down the busiest road in the area, and you know maybe one or two passes down that, and I pick up a hundred plus just regular Pokeballs, and that's not counting great and Ultra Balls. So you know that way you stock up essentially when you're in an area that has a lot of pokey stops that way when you're in an area that doesn't you know you have a lot more pokeballs to work with i don't keep any of my regular potions or not those i keep my hyper potions but that's it and um so spin if if you're going to spend the coins if you're going to get coins i'm going to recommend basically bag upgrade is my first priority you know i have 600 item slots now so that's plenty i think that's 200 coins five upgrades that's um a thousand coins to do and then i don't buy lure modules because pretty much everywhere i go to to hunt pokemon the the modules or the uh the stops are already lured so i don't really buy those i i'll keep some coins on hand in case i get somewhere and everybody's putting on one. If, if I'm in a four pokey stop area where you're basically in four pokey stops at once, I'll pick up one and everybody puts up one. Lucky eggs, I do recommend investing in, and I typically buy eight or 25 at a time. And if you buy 25, you're going to be set for a very long time because the only time I use lucky eggs is when I've collected 300 plus Pokemon, and that's you know transferring into to where I only have enough Pokemon or candy to evolve the Pokemon. So, and then I burn an egg and, you know, pick up between 50 and 150,000 XP off of one lucky egg. Um, it really depends on how fast it goes and lag. So essentially with your coins, back to the original topic at hand, I'm always going to recommend bag upgrade is your first priority and have some lucky eggs on hand. I'd say pick up eight lucky eggs um, maybe eight incense and don't worry about Pokemon storage upgrade. You really don't need that right now until gen two comes out where there's a lot more variation of Pokemon and then incubators. I let's face it. If you're, if you're walking to hatch eggs or you're, you know, if you're one of the ones that drive and hatch eggs or however you hatch your eggs, the more you can do it once, the better. I mean, I pretty much like to have all nine of mine going all the time. That's where I put my investment is because to me, that's investing in, in Pokemon candy or dust one way or another. I'm getting something that's going to benefit either my top Pokemon, or if I get something new, that's better my egg Pokemon or hatched Pokemon, if you will. So I'm going to say that the best place to spend your coins and, and I'll repeat, I know I'm repeating this, but is priority one is bag upgrade Priority two is to have a couple lucky eggs and incense on hand. And priority three is going to be egg incubator. When you are using your incense, 
only use it when you're going to be moving. If you're just going to be sitting idle at, at an area, like let's say you go to a po uh, area that has multiple Poke Stops and they're all lured, don't burn an incense there. It's only going to get you six Pokemon over a 30 minute period. If you're sitting idle, you'll get one Pokemon every five minutes for 30 minutes, six Pokemon. But you can get a Pokemon every minute if you are moving at a rate where you're covering 200 meters per minute because every 200 meters traveled a Pokemon will spawn off of an incense so honestly you know being that you know when you're driving at high speeds if you're going you know down a highway or you're riding you know you're on a road trip with family or whatnot use your incense then because you're gonna be driving at a fast pace and you're gonna be getting Pokemon constantly so that's where you, you need to use your incense when moving and lure modules, whatnot, when you're idle. Don't use a lucky egg to catch Pokemon unless you're just starting the game and you have no Pokemon pretty much in your Pokedex and then, then you can pop an incense. Other than that, that's what I feel is the best way to use your coins. If you're a spender, do what you do. You have fun. But if you're just a mild spender, you only pick up a little bit here and there or you do the surveys or something like that, try to be more try to go for things that are going to be more permanent to your account than like bag upgrades and things like that because pokeballs are very disposable and you're going to run through them like crazy especially when you get higher level because the higher level you are the harder it is to catch pokemon but i'm going to go ahead and call it for this video like subscribe if you want to see more i've got two other informational style videos like this um, i've got some gameplay videos coming for gyms um I'm going to apologize for the delay in getting these videos out. I've kind of had a lot going on, but I'm back at it, and I'm going to start getting them out there, try to get them out there every day for you guys. Again, like, subscribe, share, and I've got a giveaway that I'm going to be doing soon. I'm going to do a uh, iTunes gift card or Apple Store, whatever the Apple Store gift card is. I'm an Android user, so whatever the gift card is for Apple Store, and I'm going to do a Google Play gift card. So I'm going to be doing a giveaway to two, to two people. And I'm trying to think of the terms of the giveaway. I think it's going to be something with something in the comments, maybe with best question um, or best video topic for doing another video or something like that. And then, um, and then also you must, you know, you have, you must be subscribed to win. So you know, share with your friends, get it out there, and I will talk to y'all later. Peace.